YouTube world, this is a review. Um, I'm actually going to be coming to you guys uh, today here on YouTube world to talk to you about skincare. Uh, something that is very important for a lot of us ladies and gentlemen in the community um, and in the world and YouTube world to work on our skin. Um, one of the issues that I personally been having as well as a lot of women uh, and men um, is hyperpigmentation. So a lot of times us is, um, that have melanin in our skin or African Americans, we suffer from hyperpigmentation and discoloration as well as um, some people have um, rosacea and stuff like that. So it's a lot of different products. I have used a lot of different things as far as bleaching creams. The highest percent of bleaching cream that you can get over the counter is 2%, which is hydroquinone. Anything higher than that, you have to go see a dermatologist. And they can go as high as 4%, from 4% and as high as 10% for bleaching. But sometimes when you use some of those bleaching agents, it'll lighten it and then it'll, it can, other things can cause it to darken back up. So, I've just been catching hell here lately. <laughs> so, I had to go back to my roots, which is Kiehl's. Kiehl's 1851. I have been using this product for over 15 years. It's an excellent product. I was introduced to this product um, by a friend. Um, and it's so funny how I really get first found out about Kills. This was some years ago. Um, Miss Mary J. Blige had came. This is when MAC Cosmetics and all that stuff was popping. And matter of fact, Mary J. and Little Kim and all of them were spokespersons for Matt Cosmetics. Make a long story short, she was doing a radio interview. So on the radio interview, they was she was they were saying how pretty she looked, and she got her makeup, and what does she do to work on her skin? And this was one of the products that she mentioned. This was prior to Carol's daughter and all of that. Kills 1851 as well. The D was used. <laughs> so I told my friend, I said, Oh, we gotta go get us some kills. <laughs> so that's how I started using it. Well, make a long story short, I come here to tell you about the awesome products that they have, what they retail at, what they're used for, and what you can do for your beauty regimen. Um, my skin type is normal to oily, but here lately I've been being dry. I haven't been drinking enough water. I don't know what's going on. But, um, I pray things get back to normal. So, anyway, um, the first product is your cleanser. So, this is, I don't know if you guys can see, this is the cleanser here, um, that they offer. And this cleanser is for, um, this is for kind of dry skin. Now, normally, I use a different cleanser, but because I've been being dry, I said, well, I need to add some moisture. So, this is called the Cucumber Herbal Conditioning Cleanser with Cucumber Extract. And it's for all skin types, particularly dry to sensitive skin types. Real light, um, excellent product. And this particular product here, I purchased at the Kiel store. And this retails at, let's see. Okay, what is, okay. Okay, so this one, re this cleanser retails at $25. So this is $25 here. And uh, it's really good. This is a nice size. Um, it can last you for a while. It's um, 5.0 ounces. So you, this this usually can last a good. I say you can, if you use it sparingly, you, you can stretch this out about three months. Okay. So this is the cleanser. And after you use your cleanser, um, you know you have to exfoliate 
Um, they quit making the um, ultrasonics. I need one of them too. Because that's good for hyperpigmentation to try to work on it and stuff. But my skin had got burnt because I don't know if a lot of you um, ladies and some gentlemen out there, they get um, laser hair removal. So I had, you know, a lot of times we go and get it tweezers or, and if you shave, it get thicker. So you can't do that. You have to go get it waxed. Make a long story short, these lasers, they be turning the machines up and be fucking your skin up, okay? So, it's like you get rid of one thing, and then now you got a new damn issue. So, exfoliate, exfoliate, exfoliate. So, now they had a new exfoliation that the guy there was telling me about, um, that they just, in a, well, it's been around for a minute, but um, I'm old school. So, I've been using the product for so long, I use the pineapple papaya facial scrub. Now, this is the bomb. So it's an enzyme in pineapples and papaya to break down the, the skin and stuff. It's really good. And back when I was using this product from Kiehl's, it came in a jar. It came in a jar like this. But they switched over from the jar to the tube that you squeeze out. Which is better because it's more sanitary and um, you won't you know, cross-contaminate and stuff like that. So they changed um, the packaging for this. But when it originally came out, it was in a jar. So they put it in a squeeze, which is good. And um, this is your exfoliate. So you do your cleanser first. Then you do your uh, scrub. And this works good. Um, I haven't used it in a while because I haven't had the money and stuff to get it because Kiehl's is a little pricey and expensive, but I'm here to tell you I am a diva on the budget. I do go to CVS. I do use Cedarfield. I use Cocoa Butter. I use Dollar Store stuff. I use what I can use to work on what I need to work on, but at some point you do have to invest in some good products. Sometimes Marshalls and TJ Maxx, they have good skincare stuff that you can get, you know, for a little fraction of the cost. But I just love this product. So I had a few little dollars and I said, I'm going to get me some kills, honey. <laughs> so yeah, this scrub is good. And um, this is the, like I say, it's the pineapple papaya scrub and it's made with real fruit extract. So that's another thing I like about Kiehl's product. It's all natural and it's real. They use, you can eat this. Like, it's really good. Um, and that retails, the pineapple papaya scrub retails for $28. And that is a 3.4 ounce. This can last you up to three months if you use it sparingly as well. So then after you use your um, cucumber cleanser, and then you use your pineapple papaya scrub. And then you use a toner. You know, that's supposed to like get your pH balance and tone the skin and just keep you on balance. And um, the guy in the store, he was really nice. He said that um, this, is, this particular product is considered... Uh, the golden product. It's gold in the bottle and it is really good. It's a really good toner. You can usually put, use uh, cotton balls to put it on. Kind of like how you do that. Now when you can't purchase uh, a, a good toner to use, when you can't purchase, say, Kills, you can use Witch Hazel. Okay? Witch Hazel is good as a t you can use as a toner and to remove your makeup. But I prefer to use... Um, what do you call them? Um, Sometimes I use the baby wipes with aloe vera to remove the makeup. Um, but um, which hazel is good. But this is a good toner here. And the name of this toner is called... Um, it's got chamomile in it. It's alcohol-free. And it's for normal to oily skin tight extract and toner and it's alcohol free and look at it it got like the little leaves and stuff in there you see that hold on let me show y'all you see the little leaves and the product it got in there honey just some good stuff here honey <laughs> so that particular uh the toner uh, that 
was a little pricey. Now that was about forty dollars for this toner, but uh, when you're trying to be a diva, it costs. Okay, so that's your toner. So you do like I said, you do your cleanser. You use your scrub, pineapple papaya scrub. Then you follow that up with your toner. Okay, boom. Then after you do your toner, then you have to moisturize. But uh, in between you doing that process, you have to, sometimes your pores get clogged up and stuff and you may get breakouts or you, your pores get clogged and you need to unplug your claws and purify your skin. So die. when I tell you, it's a lot of clay mask. A lot of people use mint julep. Um cucumber mask. Now, it used to be one Queen Helen used to make back in the day. <laughs> called the, uh, oh, they quit making it called egg white facial. It was the bomb. But you can you can do that yourself. You can crack an egg and do that. But make a long story short. Uh, oh, a lot of people use that. Um, it's another clay mask. I forget, but it's real popular here on YouTube, a lot of people talk about it where they mix it with the um, mother's vinegar and mix it up. It's a clay. But anyway, this one is the bomb too by Kiehl's, okay? And it's good for your pores and purifying and stuff like that and getting rid of breakouts. And this is called the Rare Earth Deep Pore Cleansing Mask, okay? And it's got Arizona, Arizonian white clay. Okay, so you know it's from Arizona, the mountains and stuff like that. Excellent product. Check this out. Okay, that's that's for your mask. You do that probably like twice a week. And that particular product um, retails at, let's see, Rare Mask. Okay, that retails, this one retails at $38. Okay. And you do this probably twice a week. But your, your cleanser, your scrub, and your toner, you use that daily. And then you follow up with a moisturizer. And this is their Ultra Facial Cream. And it's real light, and it's got SPF 30. So I have it on now, okay? So now I'm specifically talking to uh, my ladies and gentlemen who have melanin in their skin, a lot of times when we use sunscreen, and yes, African Americans have to use sunscreen because the ozone layer is fucked up, and these goddamn sun rays is coming through here fucking people up, and you know it's been that bad. Anytime black bitches got to put on sunscreen. <laughs> we was in the field, our ancestors was in the field. With potatoes and, and, and corn and, and picking cotton and all. And we ain't wear sunscreen. But if you need 2021 and beyond, you better put some goddamn sunscreen on. Okay? So, with that being said, um, a lot of times when us people with melanin, also my Latino sisters with melanin, we put the sunscreen on and it leaves that film on your face. If y'all use sunscreen, you know what I'm talking about. And how you looking like smoky nor for a real gray in the face. You know. Uh, it, it's like you can rub it in. But it it um, leaves like a smear. So like I said. You people who wear sunscreen. You know exactly what I'm talking about. And so this is why I like this product. Because I have it on now. Look how light it is. And it don't. You don't. It don't. It don't give that a look of. Um, you got sunscreen on, but you have it on. It just gives you a natural glow. It's the bomb. <laughs> so, yes, ladies and gentlemen, try this product. It is a bomb. This, even if you don't buy none of the other stuff I just talked about, if you just want a good sunscreen and you don't want um, to have that film, I hate that. Because um, I've used, like, Cedarfield got a sunscreen I've used. I've used a lot of different sunscreens, but it all of them leave that grayish film on your face. This doesn't. So if you don't want that, purchase this product. Um, it's a moisturizer and it's got SPF 30 in it. And uh, and it says 24 hour everyday hydrating uh, formula. Um, and it's supposed to last. And this particular product, how much was this? This retails at Oh, let's see where 
れてて。Uh, okay, that retails at fifty five dollars. This retail this, but they have a smaller size. But this this particular size retails at fifty five. <clears throat> so, um, I just want to get on YouTube and tell you about Kills and the awesome products that they offer. Um, you know and. You know, just ladies and gentlemen that's dealing with issues with hyperpigmentation, breaking out. Yes, you have to go see a dermatologist for certain things, whether you're using your retinase, retinols, your anti agents all of that stuff. Um, some of those things you need prescriptions for. And But some of those products I have learned over the, the process of going to a dermatologist sometimes, it thins the skin and... It's like you clear you clear something up, but then you're fucking something else up. So it's just like, ugh, it, you just it's a trip. So it's good to get some good products that um, you know, that's not gonna mess your skin up. But one of the main reasons I want two kills is because um, when you purchase their products, they give you samples. They, they, they I load up on samples. So make a long story short, I had got a sample. This was probably. Mm, Maybe about six months ago, and I was explaining to them that I had hyperpigmentation and the issue that I was having. So they they have a serum, um, a spot corrector serum. So for people who have acne spots, black spots, discoloration, you know, a lot of black women, we have it on our chins and stuff like that. Some people have it on their cheeks and stuff like that, but it's called um dark spot corrector when i tell excuse me but when i tell you that shit they um they gave me when they gave me the sample and these are the samples so usually the samples come in like little packs like this i just had they get they had gave me like a couple handful i was using i was like oh this shit work <laughs> so i never did go back so i went back to get it it's it's kind of expensive but when i tell you it worked it worked so this is the product here. And this is the um, spot correct, dark spot corrector solution. So this is good for hyperpigmentation, uh, discoloration, spots, but it's expensive. But baby, it works. Now don't get me wrong. I use Ambi. I use hydroquinone, 4%. I even got hydroquinone, 10%. Okay, I use Retin-A. I use all of those things that I have went to a dermatologist to use, but I learned with some of those products that you go to a dermatologist be sometimes too strong, and it can mess your melanin, and sometimes it can throw your pH off on your skin. So I'm getting back to my roots of the natural products that I've been using and that I know work. So, and Kiehl's is known for being, you know, a good product. Um, so this particular spot corrector, ladies, if you had suffer from uh, hyperpigmentation, discoloration on the cheeks, so the chin or the neck, honey, this is an excellent product. Like I said, Ambi is cool, but the, it don't have enough hydroquinone in it. It's only on half, in the United States, you only can get 2% hydroquinone. Anything higher than that, you have to get a prescription. But sometimes when you get that stuff, like I said, it'll clear it up. Then it darken back up, clear, darken back up. So it's like it'd be like a process. So, but you get it light and do what you need to do, and then just get you a good um, regimen and some stuff to, you know, go with it. So these products will work good along with going to a dermatologist and getting you some Retin A or maybe a bleaching cream or something like that. Oh, and along with this, these products. Um, but this spot corrector is a little pricey. This is like the medium size. It comes small, medium, and large. Originally, I picked up the large one. And honey, it was like $150. I was like, oh no, we're going to put that back. <laughs> so I ended up getting this size. And I want to say that particular size, this it retails at $84. So now I'm here to tell you, I'm a diva on a budget. And if I'm going to spend $84 for some spot corrector and discoloration, that means I'm taking it serious. And I suggest the rest of you hoes take it serious, okay? So, with that being said, if the product work for $84, bitch, it work. <laughs> Excuse me for cussing. I'm sorry. 
Um, but anyway, it's an excellent product. Check it out. Go in there, get you some samples. Um, and if you spend, I want to say, they also have a gift set. So now I just purchased the bigger stuff, but they do have a smaller gift set with the cleanser, the spot corrector, and I want to say a moisturizer in it for $90. They do have a gift a gift set in there with the smaller sizes for ninety dollars. So if you just want to try that, um, just to see how the products work with your skin, I suggest you to go in there and give it a try. Now, a lot of different areas don't necessarily have a particular Kiel store. Me personally, I prefer to go to the Kiel store because they be a little bit knowledgeable of the product. Um, versus going to maybe Nordstrom's or Neiman's. Or, you know, one of those places to get the product. Um, your first time trying Kiehl's, I suggest you could find an actual Kiehl store. They wear their lab coats. And when I tell you the people in there know about skin, they know about skin and they know what they're doing. Um, so, I also I got a free gift um, for purchasing this. They, get, they had some hand sanitizer because of the COVID-19 and all that's going on. They got um, some hand sanitizer. So, I'm going to try that. And I got a bunch of goodies and samples and stuff. Oh, and it's another product. So now, you know, the new craze is that um, the CBD, the cannabis, CBD is good for your skin too. So, Kiehl's have a cannabis cleanser and it's called, uh, it's a cannibal, cannabis herbal cleanser. Okay, with cannabis seasoning. Okay. So they say marijuana is good for you, okay? We ain't, we ain't talking about the puffin, but for your skin, okay? CBD uh, and the, um, the herbal extract, um, cannabis extract. So anyway, this is another product that they have. This is one of the free samples. This is one of the free gifts that I have. Um, get gap for me purchasing uh, my products and stuff. So like I said, give Kills a try. Like I said, I've been using it for years off and on. Um, I might, you know, here lately I haven't been as consistent because I haven't had the, the funds or the money to go get some of the stuff. But if you get a break look and get a few dollars, ladies and gentlemen, go in there and check Kills out. If you're here in the um, DMV area, um, we got a real nice mall um, called Tyson's Corner. They have a Kiehl's store in there. The guy in there, he was very nice and he was very helpful. I forget his name. I want to say his name was Michael. I can't remember, but go in there, pick you up some products, go online. Um, like I say, they do have a gift set for $90. I just splurged a little bit um, because I'm tired of the issue that I've been having the summertime coming. Plus, we've been wearing those fucking masks because of COVID-19. So, if you is having skin issues, sometimes them fucking masks is, is breaking. It's breaking people out. It's making the shit worse. So, go out, get y'all some skincare so you can work on your skin up under them goddamn masks. Because at some point, we're going to have to come up out them other fucking masks. So, hugs and kisses. God bless. Thumbs up the video, like the video, more content's gonna come, subscribe to the channel. I want to give a shout out to all the people on here that do reviews for skincare, beauty regimens, all of that, my purse community, all the divas here on YouTube. Thank you for making room for Miss Bianca. Hugs and kisses to everyone and y'all enjoy your day. Like, subscribe, and thumbs up the video. Hugs and kisses and enjoy your day. I'm, I'm not getting any sponsorship from Kiehl's 1851, but if Kiehl's happen to see this video and you want to send me some things, you sure can, and I could be a spokesperson for how good the spot corrector work when I get this goddamn discoloration. <laughs> so thank y'all for tuning in. Love you all. Hugs and kisses, and God bless. And remember, keep your head to the sky, and God love us all.